original jump starts. There we Actually, go. Seal. We are live. Bring it to South Africa when I come back. We are back live. It's taken us a while. We've had uh, problems between ourselves and Australia, but apparently we have sorted them out. Elki has done an amazing job of troubleshooting all the nonsense on that side. Uh, Ansel, thank you so much for taking time out to be with us today. Oh, it's a pleasure. Always a pleasure. Cool. So we've done, we've done, we've had two rounds of Jumpstart. We ha almost had three, but we had serious technical difficulties with round two. So that's going to be replayed at 6 p.m. Um, but we had round one, which was mono blue versus mono black, which was quite funny, um, and ended in a draw of 1-1. One, one. And then the other session we had was uh, Demir. I was playing blue black against Clayton, who was playing Boros in white red. Uh, and I took that one 2-0. So again, I've been accused of, of beating up my patrons. But I just, I just got lucky. That, that's all it was. So, so we're here for the penultimate round of today's March of the Machines Jumpstart live stream event brought to us by Unplug Yourself after supplying all these, these packs and things. Uh, Ansel, your, your packs that you technically have been given uh, have been delivered to your local address. <laughs> yes, yes. Uh, I've actually seen what was pulled out of the packs. So. Oh, okay, cool. So you got. Uh, I'm hoping you got some decent stuff. But uh, I'm kind of hoping one of us will pull green because we haven't seen green yet. So well, I reckon. Uh, let's just pull green and red. So we should be able to work with that. All right, cool. So I reckon thing. let's just jump into it and crack these babies and see um, see what we're going to be playing. So yeah, yeah. opening my first pack. And I have got me some green. Look at that. Ha. And well, so do you. I've got some green as well. <laughs> so, green. <laughs> so, so green, green. It's green, they said, on the far side oh, of the hill. Oh, jeez. You're joking. We'll mono green. A one one counter team going there. So I'm going mono green. Both my packs are green. No. Oh, okay. Well, let's have a look at the other one. I mean, those rays are pretty good. So I'll drop those out. Oh, green white. Green white so for you. Thing. So that sounds like a plus one plus one counters vibe. Ooh, realm breaker. The Surak and Goreclaw. Oh, that's not bad. Yeah, that's yeah, not I bad. I think that's actually what Carl pulled out of this pack that I was playing. Oh, you to, are uh, joking, dude. <laughs> this is jump start. I'm sorry. Did you see what I just got? Oh, nice. Well, we're jealous. In a jump start pack. What? Okay. So you mana green, right? I'm just going green, dude. I'm just going to shuffle. Can I open a pack until I get to double green and maybe a, <laughs> a, 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 a ren of my own? Hey, get, get, a, get another ren. That sounds like a plan. Um, anyway. I, I, I'm quite fortunate. I... I, I this is probably this is the fourth realm breaker that i've opened so realm break is cool it is it is realm uh, break is cool. yeah i actually I, I i got the commander deck so um i actually pulled him out of those packs amazingly enough okay i really i don't like doing this not sleeved so i'm trying to be as nice as i can to the cards uh me neither me neither so um, let's just let's just do uh Easy. <laughs> oh, you know, they, they, they shun on those sort of things in a tournament. So yeah, no, the, people are like, what are you doing? Down, then we're all good. What are you doing? What are you doing? So let's do that and do this and this and that and that and this and this and that. I'm going to roll two six sided dice on this side. Let's see how we go. I get. Eight. Eight. I was gonna. Hang on. I'll have to find. I, I, I've got two twenty-sided dice nearby. I can. I can roll for you if you like. That'll... Yeah, do it. Do it. You also get eight, right? So we'll roll again. I will yeah. go for me. Uh, I get a whole snake eyes too. And you get five. So it's your call. Play or draw? Um, I, I think I'll, I'll try and get the, I, I'll try and get a hit start. Sounds like a plan. Yeah. 
Okay, I'm hoping I, I get some green mana. <laughs> Strangely enough, I'm going to mulligan. <laughs> going to mulligan? I am going to mulligan. <laughs> oh, I, I got some limited all stars, so um, I, might, I, might, I might keep these. I just, I had one land and no ramp. Oh, no ramp in green. That's horrible. Yeah. So I will. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Yeah, okay. I'll keep this and I will bottom that. Alrighty, and I do I do believe, sir, that it is uh, you to to take. Oh, I just threw a card on the floor. Judge. <laughs> oh, you must have been at a modern tournament recently. <laughs> yes, at a, a Comp Oriel modern event recently. You should check out uh, Jonathan's uh, tournament report on the EGG website. It's actually quite cool, and we're going to be putting up. Um, Metagame stats later tonight as well for what was happening there. <sighs> but well, after all, I did take part. My you did. Was on the list, wasn't it? You did. You got it. You, <laughs> you had a ticket there. That's for sure. Um, right. So we're ready to go. It's rock and roll. Okay. Play my full art um, forest there. Oh, very and, nice. I'm going to pass the turn. Okay. Alrighty. I will draw my card for turn. I will play a non full art forest and then I shall pass the turn. Alright, draw a card. I can't believe I pulled a Ren and Realm Breaker in a jump start pack. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look, you, don't, you don't need to play it when you get it in your hand. Um, I'm going to play another fence land, a, a foily uh, plane. Foily planes, very then, nice. Um, I'll be playing a, a green and a colorless and i'll be playing the, the best three one probably in the sets um it is a weary uh thespian yes and when it comes into play i can surveil one yes you can and when it dies you and can do the I'll same one. and uh, i'll keep that on top of my library because it's really fancy okay and i walk the turn fantastic i'll draw a card for my turn And then... Uh, do I need to get the space bar or something so that we can pass it through? Oh, right. There we go. Space bar. I drew my card. Yeah, I will play the card another one of these cool forests. And then... I am going to pass the turn. Oh. Much Must to my own chagrin, I'm <laughs> going to pass the turn. Uh, draw a card. Wow, uh, I've been on the ball. I've Imagine, I, I wonder if you knew what that card was. Um, oh, I have to think about this one. Oh, I'll just go to combat. Sure. And I'll come through for three. Uh, I'll take it right in my face. And I'll pass the turn. Cool. I will draw for turn. Oh, you would have been really handy like a turn ago. Um, I'll play a forest. Hmm. I'll tap two. Oh, wait, do I want to tap two? Or. Oh. Yeah, I think I, um, I'm I'm gonna pay three, and I'm gonna play Realm Breaker, the Invasion Tree. Oh. Yep. What did that thing do again? Uh, so I can pay two, tap Realm Breaker. Target opponent mills three cards. I get to put a land card from their graveyard onto the battlefield tapped under my oh, control. Yeah. 
and it gains if this land would leave the battlefield, exile it instead of putting it anywhere else. Then I can also pay 10, tap and sacrifice Realm Breaker the Invasion Tree, search my library for any number of Praetor cards, put them onto the battlefield, then shuffle. So, could could be something, could be nothing, you know, but I'm going to pass it to Just a bit of ramp, actually, in this format. Well, yeah, technically. Because <laughs> right. I'm not sure if I'm getting to 10, 10, and I don't think I have any Praetors. <laughs> <laughs> not that we know. Not that I know of. Okay, right. Uh, I'll untap. I'll draw. Wow. We have no problem with lands, so we're on four lands there. Sweet. Uh, I'll go to combat. Yes. We'll come through for three. I, I will block it with my nose. <laughs> and then in my second main phase, mm -hmm. um, we'll tap four. Wow, and okay. I will cast a Tiller of Flesh. Ooh. It, a 2-4, whenever I cast a spell that targets one or more um, permanents I control, I incubate for two. Nice! And I'll pass the turn. I will untap and I will draw for my turn. And then I will tap two. To play a Ruins Recluse, which is a 1 1 spider with reach and death touch. I can pay 3 in a forest and put a plus 1 plus 1 counter on Ruins Recluse. But for now, it's a, it's a 1 1, you know? A 1 1 e, 1 1. Mm -hmm. And. Um, yeah, we like 1 1. I'm gonna pass the turn there. Well, the green deck is not having it. Much, much luck on lands there. No, no, it's not. No, draw card, return. Did you draw something nice? <laughs> I'm gonna play forest. Oh, so getting the, jealous the here. The land invasion continues. I'm getting jealous. Oh, oh it's not, not, not that great, but we'll, we'll cost him anyway. I'll play four for a zero one. Oh yeah, this is I know what this yeah. is. Converter beast. Yeah, nothing fancy, um, but it does create a, a rather large a, incubation. Um, yeah, incubation. I, I'm gonna use uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna use my buff token because he's cool. gonna be pretty buff. He's a and it's a, I'll, it's I'll, a five, I'll is it? Twenty yeah. sided buffs on there. <laughs> wow. Um, and then I um. Uh, I think I'm going to continue to combat and put you under a little bit of pressure and I'll come through for five if that's okay. It will take me to nine. I don't particularly have any answers right now. I'll take the five. Oh, down to nine. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's a bit rough. Yeah, I'll pass the turn. I will. I'll, I'll leave the one land open. And don't tap. Know what for. <laughs> Draw. Oh, good grief. You're kidding me. I'm, I'm so dead. Um, okay, so what I, what I am going to do is I'm going to tap to. I'm going to play Cosmic Hunger on my Ruins Recluse, dealing damage equal mm -hmm. to its power to your three, your three power creature. This one. Yeah. And he's a, a goner. Yeah, yeah, he's a, he's a goner. Um, and then I'm, I'm going to pass the turn because I have no land to play. <laughs> In this uh, mono tap. green deck. <laughs> <laughs> right, draw a card. Oh, I've still got plenty of land, so Jeez. we'll carry on with that. Um, I'll tap six. Wow. And I'm going to play a Timberland Ancient. Oh, jeez. Um, it's a 6-5 Trampler. Yes. Uh, and then I'll go to combat. 
And yeah. I think I'll come through for two. For two. And then uh, we'll pass it, eh? Yeah, I'll take the two, I'll go to seven. I will untap, I will please be a land. Oh, thank God. I'll play the forest, woohoo! Um, I will pay four for my own converter beast. Mm, and nice. I will I will do the do the incubator for five thing. Mm -hmm. Which really doesn't help me right now because I'm about to get trampled to death. <laughs> but pass the turn. Okay, well then tap. wanting to confirm because I can't remember if I transform an incubate token it doesn't have summoning sickness correct or does have some does sickness. not have summoning sickness because you controlled the permanent at the beginning of your upkeep oh okay so we're gonna uh, flip him we'll pretend he's the back of a magic card and then um, I think we'll go to combat yeah. and I'm gonna attack with a lot yeah, and, and I'm just going to die because I don't have enough blockers. Yeah, I did have a Echinoid adaptation anyway, just in case. Yeah. Well, I had I had, I had had another Converter Beast and a Kami and a Timberland Ancient and a Ren and Realm Breaker. But that didn't really yeah, do I much. Yeah, I had but uh, no counters to... to but I did, I, look, I did waste two mana. I could have probably spent three and flipped him for free. Probably. Yeah. So, so game one to you. Yeah, we're gonna sideboard. No, I don't. <laughs> there's no sideboarding here. <laughs> there's, there, there is no sideboarding here, mate. <laughs> no, no, I didn't think so. <laughs> we, we simply reshuffle and pray we get better draws. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll carry on bending my my ozolith just to make sure that it's well well played. You know, <laughs> show people that you care. <laughs> there were people in chat earlier who were literally cringing at the fact that there were no sleeves, and we were just like, "Well, you know." Uh, look, uh, yeah. It is what it is. I think I, I, I actually think the Ozolith might be a little bit overrated, to be honest. With the new one? Is it, uh... Yeah, the new one. Is not yeah, I, I still prefer the original. I must be honest. Oh yeah, yeah. And if you have a set of them, then you, you you're well on your way to doing a decent affinity deck. Model. Yeah, for sure. Okay, I shall play first. What the what what's the what's the verdict on this one uh, jump start stuff? Well, so far I'm really enjoying them. Um, I I think they're good fun. I th and also, I mean, the fact that look, generally I've in the past I've found that the value hasn't been so great, but judging from what we've pulled today. They've, this, I mean, there's been some, some well, decent yeah. cards. Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, Ozolith today for me is pretty good. Yeah. It's a card I'm looking for. Okay, well, I think Although I'm going to... I have to say, I had to, I had to hunt for the, the one box in Sydney, so... <laughs> Not a popular set in Australia. Uh, I don't think it is. I think the, the Jumpstart is the sort of set that you, you want to use. I think it's great for stores. I think yeah. this is the sort of thing that that Watsi should give to stores and go, look, if you got guys coming to play, drop these into, you know, those little um, booster pack sort of plastic things yeah. and give it to the guys. So I was, this this should be what, this should replace, this should replace the, the old welcome packs. Agreed. Yes. And you should, totally you, you should just page. be able to go like, hey, here's two packs, shuffle them together, play with a mate, you know? Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, and I mean that's 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 where my thinking is. But I'm gonna. Are, are you good with your hand? Are you happy? Have you have you drawn? Yeah. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna deal my hand first. Cool. Did you want to cut? Uh, sure. Uh, I, yes. <laughs> <laughs> About two thirds of the way down. That's right. Two thirds of the way down, uh, and then put the others on top. <laughs> oh, and take the bottom one off the bottom and put that on the very top. 
Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, I suppose it's up to you. I suppose you want to get the head start. Uh, yes, I, I said I would play it first. So, are you happy with your hand? Uh, no, I think I'm going to mulligan quickly. A mully. It is a mulligan. So tell me, does Jumpstarts have free mulligans or? No, <laughs> oh, no Appa dark, apparently so. not. <laughs> oh, the rules have changed. <laughs> apparently not. Apparently free mulligans are only for commander <laughs> players. Which I, I don't quite understand. I, I'm, I'm, I'm looking, I'm having a conversation next week, which I'm very excited about with regards uh, a certain new product that's coming uh, called Lord of the Rings. So I'm excited about that for next week. Uh, also, I'm quite keen to see what uh, what I can do in, in Arena with the new Obnixilis fellow, the uh, captured, the what captured king? Oh, yeah. yes. I kind of like him. Uh, yeah, I'll keep this one. Um, I'll, I'll put my... Um... That one. At that, the that one. That card. Yeah. Cool. I will. That, that, yeah, that one. Play a for full forest, oh, and, oh, and pass the turn. Oh, it's almost as if the tables have turned. Something like that. When all we've really uh, done is pass the turn around the table. No. <laughs> there we go. I'll play my foily forest and pass the turn. Alrighty. I will draw a card for turn. Wow, these guys just keep on coming. I will do this. I will tap those two for a Ruins Recluse. We've seen him before. 1-1 mm. Death Touchy Fellow. Past turn. Uh, I'll draw. Mm. I'll play Planes. Uh -huh. And I will play uh, my Weary Thespian. This guy again. Um, he's been to have appeared again, so let's take that. You surveil. Oh yeah, I can surveil. Yep. And I'm gonna surveil that into my graveyard. There we go. Forest. Coolie coolie. Uh you passing? I am passing. Got All nothing right. else to do. Untap draw. Okay, I will play a forest. And I will not attack into your thingamajiggy because it's big and stuff. Oh, but he's only got one defense and you got death touch. No, I know, but I've only got the one okey pokey and yours does like three damage. So, I mean, you know, I lose, lose, lose. Yeah. Um, although... Yeah. No, I can't do that. I'm afraid the lighting in my office has gone for a ball of poop, and I'm, I, I almost thought that this four mana value card was a, a one green. And I was like, well, I should do that. Then I was like, wait a minute. Wait, just check that before. You <laughs> check yourself before you wreck yourself. So to be mana efficient, let's play, let's do something. We're going to tap three, and we'll put out Realm Breaker again. Oh, okay. Which appears to be a, a thing uh, yeah. with this uh, deck. Just hold on, my dog is whining. I'm gonna pass the turn. Shady, shut up. Okay, I'll draw in the meantime. Yeah, while I yell at my dog. Oh, sorry, I should have untapped first. Usually. Oh, did I get two foily forests? Oh, you do, you get two foily yeah. basic lands. Oh, okay. And well, one full both. arty job. Both of the green one. Hmm. I think. Cheating. What do you think? Yeah. Uh, this is what I think I'll do. Yeah, I'm going to yeah. tap a green. Uh huh. And a colorless. Uh huh. And I think I'll play Cosmic Hunger. Oh no. On your Death Toucher. Oh, that's that's horrible. It is. It is. I apologize profusely. My poor little, I mean, it's just a little spider. I know, but uh, you, you know, the, the brighter thing is that he's not doing his one damage, so no death touchy stuff for him. <sighs> and then, um, I am actually going to do this. I, I will go to combat. Yes. And I'm going to attack for three. Okay. I, I'm, I have no blockers. Yeah, I'm going to tap one. 
and I'm going to play um, Arachnoid adapt Adaptation, giving yes. it plus two, plus two. So I'm going to take five. I'm it. So it'll be five, yeah. Right. And then I will cross it in. I will untap. I will draw a card. I will stare at my hand and go, gee, wouldn't it have been nice to have had a um, another land? So well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to no tap two, tap round breaker, please mull uh, three cards. So we've got a inspired charge, a planes and a seal of existence. Seal from existence. All right, so I'm going to um, look through all of these things I've got up here close at hand and find not the thing that I was looking for, but I'm going to play this swamp as a planes. Uh, my swamp or your swamp? Well, it's 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 your planes, but it's this one here now. Yeah, it's going to be a swamp from now on. No, it's a planes. Yeah. I'm just, I'm only seeing my, my cards at the moment. This one, see, <laughs> see your oh, you're not seeing my picture? Yeah. Oh dear, so okay. All right, well, it's, it's, I, this, I have a planes. I have three forests and a planes now. Got it, got it. And you, and the planes I have says, if it leaves the battlefield, it gets exiled. So you don't get it back yep. in your graveyard. Yeah, yeah, so you've got two untapped lands at the moment. I do, I currently have two untapped lands. Um. And, and with that, I'll pass the turn. Okay. Right. Lauren Pratt. Oh, there we go. Oh, so many plans. Okay, <sighs> the plans. We seem, seem to be on counter sides of the argument here. Let me go to combat. Yeah, hit me. I'll come through for three. Yeah, I yeah. have no blockers. Okay, you can take the three. I took the three. To uh, the to the left 12, cheek. Right? I, uh, to the left cheek, that's where I took it. Yep, okay. So I will then tap three in my second main phase. And I'm going to play um, Seed Pot Caretaker. Okay. Um, and unfortunately, regardless of what effect I... I a uh, pass it's it's not going to be there's no legal target so it's just a 2-2 two -two. okay and i'll pass it down all righty i will untap these three swamps and this plane as well as realm breaker i will draw a card gee whiskers wouldn't it be nice if we could i don't know get something worthwhile all right we'll pay four for a converter beast Incubating for five. How big is that converter beast? It's oh, an, yeah, okay, got it. It's a naught one and brings in a, a five. Yes. Five incubation yes, I, I, thing. I know it well. um, and, and that's all I can do, so I'm going to pass. Okay, so let's untap. Untap or draw. I do like this boy. Uh, we'll play a forest. Sure. And I'll tap the forest. And we'll play this guy. Oh, He's it's the bunny. All so, yeah, 1 1 vigilance. And he's got this little extra bonus in the graveyard. And then uh, I think I'm going to go to combat and I'll come through for five. Yeah, I'm gonna block your biggest guy, whoever the biggest one is. So yeah, give me the three one, one second. And you take two. Yeah. One second. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Oh shit. Okay. Uh, give me a second. I'm sorry, I'm, sorry, I'm, sorry. Yes, it's fine. I'll go get the dogs in. Sorry, sorry. No problem. Get back. Ansel, give me one second. I just gotta go get the dogs in and close the door. My wife's just about to get home. Yeah, yeah, all good. All Sorry, good. stream. Fine.
All right, there may uh, in a short while be lots of howling and that kind of thing. That just means my wife is home. Uh, <laughs> so what did I, I took two, yes, one, two. Okay. Yeah, you took two and you blocked the three one. And, and I, then, and um, I it was threw a converter beast in front of it, okay. Yeah. And then are you passing? Yes, I'm passing the turn. Right, I will untap. I will draw. Hmm. Hmm. I will. As I as I mentioned, the barking. Yeah. Barking, pay man. pay two. To transform yes. my incubation. Oh, oh. It's now five five. Yep. And then. You should have I will. pay two to cost my own weary thespian and I will surveil and I will surveil that into my graveyard and then I shall pass turn to you okay and tap and draw wow you certainly haven't had a problem with lands yeah, I'm surprised that this, I'm, I mean, I would imagine that there should be land in the, the mono green deck. <laughs> I, I'm going to pass the turn. Okay. I will untap. I will draw. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm going to... Pay one and a, a white to cost cosmic hunger from a Phyrexian dude mm -hmm. to your three three one wary thespian. Yes, he's going to see his ass, and but I do get to surveil. Correct? You do get to surveil on the on the death trigger. Yeah. yeah. I think I might put my realm breaker into the graveyard. <laughs> 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 and uh, look for something better. <laughs> okay, and then I'm um, speaking of, of whom I'm gonna pay to tap my uh, realm breaker and ask you to mill three cards. Yeah, yeah, of course. Uh so it's a forest. It's a uh converter beast. Oh that was about to balance out the game. And it is my white rare, which is the essence of um, or orthodoxy. Cool. So then I'm going to steal your forest. So this yeah. island that I have is a forest. Yeah. It also comes into the battlefield tapped under my control. But it has that cool thing that says blah, 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 exile. Yeah, exile. Got it. All Got right, it. cool. And then I'm going to swing at you with my giant 5-5. Five five. Beastie. I think he's gonna run into this guy. What's that? He's a one one. That's the bunny. The vigilance guy. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so he's gonna so he's gonna he's gonna munch the bunny. Yeah, the the bunny's gonna uh, chump block and he's gonna die. All right, that works for me. I will then. Yep. Uh, I will then pass the turn. Okay. Draw card. Man, that is real. That's flashy. Um, well, let's do this. Let's uh, take the opportunity. To do what? What are you doing? What are you doing? We'll exile this man. What? Hey, hold on. And um, put two. Yeah. No, sorry. You, the screen changed. Yep. It's okay. It's back. So I'm exiling this man. Yes. And we're putting two plus one plus one counters on this guy. Okay. So he's now 4-4. Four, four. Okay. Um, how many creatures do you have at home at the moment? I have a weary thespian. <laughs> a he's weary he's incredibly weary right now. Because he's all alone. Yeah. Okay. Um, hmm. 
Well, I, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna come through with my old four four. Your four four? Yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna block. I'm gonna throw my wary thespian in front of him. And he's a, he's a three one, correct? He is a three one. Yeah. Okay. We'll let that. And, we'll let that go. And then I'm gonna. Arachnoid adapt adaptation him to make him a 5 3. Mm. Well, you put me in this unstrategic position, yeah. I think I will tap a white and I will tap a green. Yes. And I will um, aerial boost my guy to make him 6 6. Okay. Then my guy will die. I will surveil. Yes. And I'm empty-handed. I will keep that on top. And are you passing the turn, Sirrah? I am passing the turn because I have no cards in my hand and um, nothing else to do. I will untap for turn. I will draw this strangely familiar card. I will play said strangely familiar card. So, this is a plains, that is a forest, everything else is forest because we're mono green. We're then going to. Um, tap this forest and that plains to cosmic hunger mm. from our Phyrexian to your duty dude. That's not called for an unnecessary. <laughs> wow. Now the table just turned. <laughs> then. We're going to pay four to cast Fertilid's Favor, which says target player searches their library for a basic land card, puts it onto the battlefield tap, then shuffles, put two plus one plus one counters on up to one target artifact or creature. So I'm going to... But I don't have a creature. I, I'm, I'm targeting myself, <laughs> just so you know. Basic <laughs> land card just comes in tapped, then yeah. shuffle. So shuffling very gently so as not to scare off any of the squeamish viewers. There we go. And we'll just split there and do that. Put that over there. And then we will put two counters on this mm -hmm. guy. And we will go to combat and swing seven massive power Got it. at your face. Yeah. Yeah, no. Then that's only one, 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 one. Uh organ that's taken that and that's the face so i'm down to 13. and then i will pass the turn all right top deck mode come on baby top deck top deck oh wait sorry my own tap oh in that modern tournament i would have had a game loss already the way i'm carrying <laughs> <laughs> wow. okay well we'll tap three yes and we'll play a fairgrounds uh, trumpeter. Okay. Um, what he says is at the beginning of my end step, if a plus one plus one counter was put on a permanence under uh, under your control this turn, put a plus one plus one counter on um, fairgrounds uh, trumpeter. Okay. Um, and that, uh, unfortunately, any anything that puts plus one plus one counter on stuff is not available. At the moment, so <laughs> I'll pass with that. <laughs> all righty mm. i will untap all all of this beautiful manner that i didn't have in game one i will draw my yeah, card for turn hey how did, how did all my mana travel twelve thousand miles to get to south africa <laughs> <laughs> so i'm gonna tap two green and one two three four to play surak oh. and gorklaw mm-hmm who is a 6-5 legendary creature human bear with trample. Other creatures you control have trample. Whenever another mm -hmm. non-token creature enters the battlefield under your control, put a plus one plus one counter on it, it gains haste until end of turn. Mm -hmm. uh, and then, I'm going to move to combat. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to swing a 7-7 seven, seven trampley Phyrexian the artifact creature at you yes i'm gonna take it 
so all to, to six. All to the face. Yeah, all to the face, down to six. Okay, and then holding up two mana, I will pass the turn. Okay. I'm going to untap. I'm not seeing any lights at the end of the tunnel here. Oh! If only. We will tap to yes. top lane. Norns and Quidditcher. I do like that card. Yeah, so we'll use the front of the buff. So we <laughs> put two plus one plus one counters on it. Yes. We incubate when it comes to the um, What we'll do is then we'll um, tap two. Yes. And I'm going to transform. Okay, it, it does have summoning sickness now though. Yeah, it does, it does, it does. Agreed. But it comes, comes when it transforms, it becomes a 3-3. Three, three. Correct. And then I... Oh, that's very I'm nice synergy. To... Look at that. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to pass the turn, but because I put a plus one, plus one counter on a creature, I can put a plus one, plus one counter on there. Look at that. And I'll, and, uh, I'll have a second 3-3. Three, three. Which might not help me much, but we'll, we'll, we'll try. Okay, cool. And yep, yeah, all of your. I will untap stuff. I will draw. Oh, I must untap him. I will draw a card. Great, there goes the fence again. But at least other people are home now and they can go deal with the fence. <laughs> I'll Run <rabbit>. tap <laughs> that for. For a converter beast. Who will incubate. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is there, oh, yeah, of course you got more than one because you got two green packs. So, right? Yes. Uh, and then I will pay three. For a fairgrounds trumpeter who, because of Surak and Gorklaw, will come in with an additional plus one plus one counter on him. Mm -hmm. It gains haste until end of turn. And trample. And has trample. But so does the the, the, the zero one does as well, right? Yes, the zero one has haste and trample. It already gets a plus one plus one counter. Yeah, of course. You, you can't sell yourself short. So he's a 1-2 one, <laughs> one, with trample. <laughs> <laughs> and haste. Until end of turn. Yeah. Um, and you have a oh. grand total of 7 defense. Yeah. So, do all the creatures have oh yeah do everything's the got trample mm. i reckon we go to game three i'll give it to you well i mean let me i'm gonna swing at you with the big boys yeah, yeah okay let me know how much it is so it's 6 13 16 damage incoming yeah, that's enough, right? All trample damage. All and trample damage. Uh, you would yeah, be yeah. able to, I mean, you'd be able to block them out. And the other nine. Other nine is going to smack me straight up. Yeah. No cards in hand. Yeah. Good. Cool. Game three it is. Game three it is. We have a decider. Well done. For the first time today, we have a decider. I will, I will lose this plains and this other forest. Patreons are under pressure. Patreons, I know. Come on, you gotta, you gotta, <laughs> you know. If you do, if you don't do this, it's up to Lily and Niels. But they're both patrons, so at least there we know a patron will win. <laughs> Niels has taken so much of you, so uh, if he's gonna <laughs> get one, fine. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty. Those 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 um, commander decks actually stacked up all against each other. Yeah, they did. I'm very surprised at the Jeskai deck. I must be honest. I um I didn't think the convoke mechanic would work as well as it did, 
And in that first game, I was quite upset about how slowly it developed. But once it got going, my word, it's, uh, it's a bit of a steamroller. Although I do think Brumaz just needs a little bit of help. And then it can be quite potent. Okay. All right. Okay. So it's your choice now. Good, sir. Oh, I've got to get the head start because it's clearly been given the advantage so far. So let's have a look. Yeah, I might keep this one. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep this it's one. That, uh, yeah, it's not that great, but I'll keep it. I'll keep it. All right, All right ready to go. In that case, take it away. Okay, so we've got a forest. Cool. I'll tap it for one. Yeah. Is it above? Um, uh, it's, a bunny. it's a bunny. There you go. Cool. Yeah, pass the turn. All righty, I shall play this. F well, first I will draw, because that's what you're supposed to do. Then I will play this forest. And then I will pass the turn. I'll then tap, I'll draw. No, nothing serious. Um, I'll play planes. Yeah. I'll tap two. Okay. I'll play a uh, Alabaster Host Sacrificer. There's a 2 2 Lifelinker. 2 2 Lifelinky. Oh, yeah. I'll go to combat. Yes. No, check with this guy. Oh my gosh. Oh, I believe I take one damage to the... Oh, hold on. Yeah. We haven't reset our life totals. Yeah. yeah. That's, uh, I'll be back on 20 and you'll be on 19. I'm on 19. Uh, are you passing the turn yeah. after that? I am passing the turn. Correct. Alrighty. I will draw my card for turn. Hey, look at that. I will play a forest. I will tap those two forests for a weary thespian. And I will surveil. Oh, yes. Good. Uh, and I will keep that on top. And then I will pass the turn to you, sir. Okay. I'll draw a card. Hmm. This is interesting. 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 Very much so. This is very interesting. Uh, we shall do this. Uh, we will uh, go to combat. Yes. We'll be attacking with this vigilance creature. I will take that one. Okay. That's good. <laughs> 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 that was part of the plan. To <laughs> <laughs> uh, poke you in the face again. Uh, for getting that free damage in my second main phase, uh, it cost my Ozolith. Oh, nice. Yes, and we can start to see how this one plus one plus one counter strategy works. And we'll pass the turn. Alrighty, I will untap and I will draw. And then I will play my second foily forest. Mm hmm. We will go to combat. We will swing our 3 1 wear weary thespian towards your facial features. I'm going to be block blocking with my um, placid. Okay, but I'm going to cast the arachnoid adaptation on it so that mine does not die and I get to untap it. You get untapped. Yes, okay, done. Uh, and then Mine in my second main phase, damage. I will tap one green for my own placid rotten tail. Nice. And then I shall pass the turn to you. Oh. I will untap. I will draw. Not quite what I expected. What I will do is I will be Exiling my placid. And putting counters on things. 
putting two counters on that guy, but because I have this Ozilith, it will be three counters. There you go. He's now a 5-5 five, five lifelinker. Yeah, he is. And sure. um, you're all tapped out, right? I am all tapped out. Yeah, there's nothing like five life. I will <laughs> go to combat and I'll attack you for five. I will <laughs> throw my rotten tail in front of you. Yes, which is fair enough. And you will gain the five life. I will gain. I will be on 25. And then I'll be passing the turn. Ah, you even passed the turn. Look at that. Yeah, I got. I, I can't see what's happening on the laptop, but I can uh, hit the space bar. There we <laughs> go. Hitting the space bar is always decent. I will play a first. Then I will tap three. Mm -hmm. Actually, before I tap three. What I will do is I will uh, move to the combats and swing mm -hmm. at you for three. I uh, will be taking three. Then I will pay the three after combat in my second main phase for a fairground mm -hmm. trumpeter. What does that thing do? It's the one that says at the beginning of each end step, if a plus one plus one oh. counter was put on a yeah. permanent under your control right. to turn, put a plus one plus one counter on blah, blah, blah. And yep. keeping the one mana up here, I shall pass it. I will untap. Times two. I will draw. I will play that. How, how big is that thing that you got there? He's a 2-2. Two, two. You got two things. Just a 2-2. Two, two. He's a 2-2. Two, two. And you've right. only got that 2-2, two, two, right? I've, well, I've got the 3-1, but he's not there. He went to hit you in the face. Oh, uh, oh yes, he went. To, so he's not he's not blocking anything. No. Um, so let me go to combat. And I will attack for five. Yes, I will take that five. And you will, will gain, gain that five. And then in my second main phase, I will I will cast the game changer, uh, which is the converter beast that we've been <laughs> frequently <That's good. laughs> um, having come into the game. And I love, I I love the way we both like, oh, it's a naught one for four. It's so dumb, but geez, like this five, this massive, massive yeah. incubator. I also happen to have this Ozilith, yes. which makes it a 6-6. Six, six. Yes, yes it does. And I will pass the turn. Yowzers. Oh, excellent. Okay, I will pay player first. <sighs> then... I will tap two to mm -hmm. play a wary thespian and I will surveil. Mm -hmm. I will keep that on top. You've got a few of those guys now. Quite a few now. Then I'm going to pay three to exile the rotten tail. Mm -hmm. Putting two counters on the wary thespian. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to skip right through everything and move to my end step and put a counter on the the a trumpeter. That is just beautiful. And then I'm going to pass the turn and pray. Okay, we will untap, untap, and draw card. I mean, he's got a five-five life linker and a six-six. Phyrexian incubation happening. Yeah. Run Rabbit just asked me where my removal was. <laughs> well, the funny thing is, um, he's, he's got green white. Yeah. I've got mono green. <laughs> so, what I'm going to be doing is, I'm going to make this guy a, a, a very big green. guy. Yeah, he happens to be a 6-6. Oh, poop. Okay. And, um, 
what I'm going to do over and above that is I am also going to um, be tapping this Ozolith to put a plus one, plus one counter on him. It's a 7-7 it's a seven, seven now. But it just so happens because I put a plus one, plus one counter on him. I put two on him. Because you have the Ozolith, so he's an 8-8. Eight, eight. <laughs> <laughs> so he happens to be an 8-8. Eight, eight. Yes. Uh, then I'll go to combat and I'll be coming through just with this 8-8 eight, eight for the moment. Just with the 8-8? Eight, eight? Yeah, I'm going to throw this weary thespian in front of your 8-8. Eight, eight. Yeah. He will All die. Good. I will surveil, and funnily enough, <laughs> I will keep that card on top again. <laughs> yeah. Sounds good. And we will pass the turn. Alright. The passing of the turn. I will untap. I will draw this strangely familiar card off the top of my deck. Deja I will vu. then play a forest. Um, then I will pay six mm -hmm. to play the Timberland Ancient, who is a reaching trampling six five tree folk. Yeah, yes, we, we know that guy. We, we know, we know this guy. Yeah. Uh, and then I will pass the turn and pray again. <laughs> Okay, we will be untapping. I'm letting him untap with this massive thing, which is now going to become a 10 10. Well, yes, I mean, how? <laughs> um, I think what I'll do is uh -huh. let's tap this thing and make him a 10 10. <laughs> if that makes sense. <laughs> and as, as, as a second piece, we'll tap him. Yes. And this green one. Yeah. Uh -huh. And then we got this thing called Cosmic Hunger. Oh God. And it looks like he'll run into that, be dealing 10 damage to that 6-5 that you have To my there. tree folk. Okay, yeah. well there's nothing I can do about that. So he no longer trampled. And no, no, he, to combat. he trampled himself into the graveyard. <laughs> <laughs> we'll go to combat and yeah. we'll come through with the 10-10. Shouses. Um, yeah, I'm going to throw the elephant in front of him. <laughs> yeah, sounds good. The trumpeter person, creature. Yep, and then I will pass the turn. Yeah, I was just, come on, I need something. Something. That's really not something. Yeah, no, I really don't see a way out of this for me, so we'll just put things down to throw in the way of the 10 10. Sure, go. <laughs> How much is he? He's a 1 1. <laughs> oh, he's a 1 1? Yeah. Okay. Uh, draw card. <laughs> uh, I'll go to combat. Yeah. No, no, I'm not going to do that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to first tap. <laughs> well, tap the Ozolith. At, and but I'm going to, I, I want to make sure that I, I secure my life total. So it's, it'll be two counters on there. Making him a 7-7. Seven, seven. Yeah. We'll go to combat and we'll tackle, we'll attack with both these guys. Okay, so before I declare blockers, mm -hmm. I'm going to pay two. I'm going to cosmic hunger mm -hmm. from weary thespian to your life linky dude and mark yep. and five damage on him. How much? Five. Five damage. Yep, so he's a, basically a seven two. Yeah, uh, and then I will. Yep. Throw the weird thespian in front of your 7-2 and the little 1-1 one, one in front of your 10-10. How much is that weird thespian at the moment? So he's a 5-3. Oh, okay. What I will do is... Just, just, just mm, yeah, let it I'm die. Gonna let that, uh, I'm going to let that resolve. Yeah, <laughs> but I'll gain 7. Right? <laughs> so that dies, I'll get to surveil. Oh, really? That's... Yep. So not what I need. Oh, it goes to graveyard, doesn't it? Oh, that's actually not bad. We'll put it in the graveyard. Then this guy dies as well because he gets trampled by a 10-10 Phyrexian. Yeah. 
Yeah. Which is never nice. I, I can tell you it's it's not pleasant. Uh, and then I think in my second main phase, I know. if we have to go proceed, uh, I will tap three and I will play a my own realm breaker. Oi. And uh, I will pass the turn. Alrighty then. I will untap all this land and this amazing board state that I have and draw a land and say congratulations. <laughs> 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 Nicely done. Well played. Okay. Oh, two one, two one to get the thought, right? Two, two one to the patrons. <laughs> the nice patrons one. win Thank a match. You, Awesomeness. That was fantastic. That was good fun. It's a pity this uh, didn't yep. draw the way it should have, but that in the jump start pack. Oh, nice. Yeah, I think the watch was quite beneficial. It, it worked. Uh, it did the job. So. Um, I had some exile jobs in my hand, so nice. I, I, was, I wasn't was too worried because um, inevitably you were going to probably cast some beast and I was going to be able to exile him anyway. Well, there you go. There you go. Thank you so much Thank for you taking again. time to join us today. I really appreciate it. And as I said, your your no actual problem. packs are waiting for you. to deal with. Hey, hey. Yeah, we had all the technology. See, now he's got a whole box that he's got to go and sort out. <laughs> yeah. But anyway. I don't sell them as individual packs in Australia, unfortunately. You're not allowed to. It just hasn't taken... Well, you can, but uh, they just... Not something that sells. I think, I think the, the good thing is that long term what they should do is um, stores should actually keep a box of each. Yeah. And then um, use them for, you know, they've got all these board games that people can play. Maybe they repack these things and then they have them as... Uh, I think long term, um, over March Machines and the, the three sets that they've had, if you mix them up, it'll, it'll be interesting. Yeah, I think it might be fun. It might be good. Yeah. But yeah, uh, again, big shout out to Unplug Yourself for supplying us with our box that we, we managed to do our things with. Uh, and to have this little event, we've got one more game coming up, the rematch between uh, Lily and Niels, because they didn't manage to get their game off the ground due to technical difficulties but uh we will be doing that at six o'clock um so if you're not doing anything uh check it out otherwise again i'll keep uh, i mean i know it's not easy managing time zones and time differences between here and there so thank you very much for making the effort we really do appreciate it and we appreciate all your support man thank you very much no it's an absolute pleasure and uh yeah we've still got a ticket to give away i think so you know the, the guys were to get in on that we you, you're going to be reviewing the um, meta, meta game from the, the last modern tournament, right? Correct. There, there should be some meta, meta game breakdown going on either today or tomorrow on the website. Uh, and on Monday night, that's right, Ansel has bought a ticket for the modern event as a giveaway to somebody out there. We'll be doing that on Monday night on the Egg Pod. So keep an eye out for that. That's going to be lots of fun. But uh, yeah, if I can't play my emulator cards, and I might as well make sure somebody else can play. Somebody else can do it. That's for sure. Although if I look at the breakdown. <laughs> There was only one Amulet Titan at the last uh, the last event. But uh, let's see how that goes in, in, in event number two. But until then, thanks so much for joining us. I've got to run away for a sec. We'll be back just about six o'clock-ish for Niels you, and Legendary Lily. So Bigger and Lily. And uh, again, thanks to Elki and everybody else, Clayton, the rest of you guys who've all joined in. Uh, Run Rabbit, Ricardo from earlier. Thank you so much. It's been an absolute blast playing these cards with you guys. Um, I, I, I think these decks are, are actually a lot of fun to play. So, um, yeah, from us, uh, until we see you again soon, stay healthy, stay safe, and uh, we'll see you on the battlefield. Peace, y'all. Thank you, guys.